Alright, so today we're going to farm some cougars. We have to get a rifle for this job. Uh, the varmint rifle is not going to work for farming cougars. You're going to have to move on to something like the Springfield. That's okay. Bolt action rifle. I have a friend that uses that. It's okay. Um, personally, I use the rolling block rifle with a long scope, and you'll see why in the, the next segment here. The Carcano is more of a uh, shoot on the move type weapon so I don't really recommend that you can use it for this but don't recommend it for this the rolling block or the bolt action are probably the two best that I would recommend alright so here we are in the farming spot and the cougar spawns in between those couple of pine trees there in the distance on top of a mound so we're going to go ahead and take the shot, uh, run out there and grab him real quick. Call the horse over, use the horse to get out of here quicker. out to the road get the hunting wagon because we're going to get far more than one cougar out of this Let's grab it off the horse here and here's a bonus tip the uh, the direction that you're looking away from is where your hunting wagon is going to come from so looking west here calling it so that when it comes in it'll come in behind me and already be pointed the way I want to drive have to do some kind of complicated turning around mess. So we're going to store the cougar up, jump on, get the hunting wagon in position. Power slide there. I'd recommend not pulling it too far back, about in line with the rock you're going to be standing on so that it doesn't interrupt the spawn of the cougar. So you hop off. Be in tall trees in West Elizabeth here at the north cougar spawn in the little valley or whatever you want to call it. Just return to our sitting rock here and I'm gonna check for the see if the spawn's already up and it is up this time, so we're gonna take this one out. The spawn will generate three, two, and one star cougars. Um, I keep them all just because the, the trading is not the highest priority and I just want to get the wagon full and get out of there. Uh, some people, uh, one of my friends, he waits for perfects. Another friend, he'll take threes and twos and skin the, uh, the ones. If you skin them, I recommend bringing the carcass out of the spawn zone as well so it doesn't interrupt the spawn. And we return to our sitting rock again to wait for a respawn. Doing this video in real time, not skipping anything, just to show you how easy it is. Um, you can get a full wagon in what maybe 10 15 minutes if you're casual about it. So,
He's still not up yet. So we're going to wait a little bit longer. Um, usually I wait about 30 seconds. Sometimes I bring up the map to make sure the my player camera isn't interfering with the spawn. Because if you're in the map, the, uh, the player camera is not active at all. So the game will spawn things around you. not up quite yet so we're going to wait about 20 or so more seconds just to give it time facing away from the spawn point you always want to be facing away from the spawn point or in the map or something like that have a three star we're gonna take the shot load him up and I'm going to go ahead and cut after this to the full wagon and you can see that it does work you get a full wagon and I'm going to uh, cut to that So we are back at the full wagon and we're just going to open it up to see that I've gotten three perfect cougars and two good cougars out of this run and um, that's going to be a lot of materials for my camp. I'm going to send away the hunting wagon and since I need a lot of materials right now I'm going to go ahead and call my horse in. I'm going to get one on the back of the horse too for a total of six cougars and we're going to see what kind of quality we can get off of this one this last one we'll just get back in position See if he's already spawned up because I was there fooling with the wagon for a while. Uh, not in position quite yet. Right, the fog's really helping out with this, so I'm gonna sit facing away from the spawn for a few seconds, see if we can trigger it. To spend some more time. Check, and we have one. It's going to be a three star. Awesome. We're going to put that on the back of the horse, take it on back to camp. And just fill those materials up in probably less than 15 minutes for six cougars. So we're going to pop over to the camp and turn them in. Show you what kind of impact you get off of uh, turning in your cougars. Supplies are looking healthy right now. So we have a good cougar. He's worth 8.1 materials. good quality. And... I'm gonna get out of this menu, flee the horse. And come over here and spawn up our hunting wagon to get the rest of our cougars off of that.
drive it over here to the camp. And hop off. Head on over to Crips. Supplies are good. Start I'm turning happy in. So normally I'll turn in the good cougars first. Save the perfect for the end. Very nice. So Good turn stuff. those in. You see how big of a bar the perfects That's are. That's top notch. Excellent. Thank you. And I still have one left over for when he runs out of materials again, or just a little bit later in the process. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.